heavily inspired by the music from the 60s and 70s that was created in Cambodia, but we're, uh, you know, doing our own thing. <laughs> Dengue Fever is a great, funky, groovy, psychedelic, romantic fusion that you just, once you've listened to it once, you just can't ignore, you can't go away from. The Dengue Fever story began 10 years ago when a musician from Los Angeles headed to the Far East. Back in 1998, I went backpacking in Southeast Asia for about six months, and Cambodia was one of the countries that I visited there was something about the Khmer rock and roll music that um, really caught my attention. So I bought as many cassette tapes as I could and gathered, a, gathered them up and brought it back to the States with me. Back in LA, Holtzman hooked up with his guitar playing brother and together they went looking for a singer. Next to LA, there's a, a city called Long Beach where there's a huge Cambodian population, um, the biggest outside of Cambodia when we were looking for a singer, and we saw her perform, and I was just elbowing my brother, going, oh my God, we gotta ask her to come sing with us. She was Chon Namol, and Dengue Fever was born. <laughs> the band takes riffs and inspiration from Khmer rock, a genre from the 60s and 70s that was an unexpected byproduct of the war in Vietnam. 